Welcome to my kitten final. It's one of the qualifiers for the Top Cat Challenge. You'll probably hear some background noise. I have a open male who's a little upset because his girlfriend just gave birth and wants nothing to do with him. I'd like to give the Midwest region a big thank you for inviting me to judge my first CFA show. They did a great job with their fall feline baseball theme. It's nice to be able to virtually look at a baseball game, even though we can't really go to them at the moment. They say big thank you to our sponsors. My 15th best kitten is my best oriental short hair kitten. Great wedge on that cat, on the cat. The wedge shape flows into the ear set, the eyes shape also falls in line with the the ears really love the body on this girl when you can see her her inner sideline view when she's standing it's a like great body shape it's lean it's tubular you just want to reach out and give her the slinky stretch virtually my 14th best kitten is my egyptian mao Lovely girl, the gooseberry green eyes, which actually do match the color of a gooseberry. Lovely spine stripe on her, lovely spotting, because you want to see the randomness of the spots. And they're also like a good size. Nice firmness to the body, lovely girl. My 13th best kitten is my Tonkinese. Really nice little package here, good firmness to the body. Nice, well, actually I just love those eyes. Tonkinese seem to have the best colored eyes. His point colors are nice, great. They sort of, they flow into his body color. And he's my 13th best kitten. My 12th best kitten is my Cornish Rex. I just, Love the coloring on her, the way that it actually, the colors all intermingle. In other pictures, you can see her do her tuck. She's got the really, the ear set is great. It actually fits into the shape, the egg shape of her face. You can see like her, she has like her eye set fits in as well. And she, when she see her in other pictures, it's like she's standing on her little tiptoes, which is what you want to see with them. My 11th best kitten is one of the persons that I finaled. Really lovely girl. I mean, I can appreciate like probably how much work has gone into this coat because I have one that I've been looking after who's all white. So I know that, yeah, there, there's a lot of work to get a kitten to be show quality. Really nice roundness to her head. The, the ears are small and they fit right into the shape of the head, which is what you want to do. Really nice, big round eyes, really sweet expression. Today, she's my 11th best kitten. My 10th best kitten is my Maine Coon. Great length to this body because you want to see the rectangular length to the body, the nice squareness, the muzzle, nice profile. She's got really nice eye shape and color. Lovely amount of fur on her for her age. She is my 10th best kitten. My ninth best kitten is my best British short hair. I say this is like a nice, well actually nice doesn't begin to describe her. Like she's a great little package. She's got the body that you wanna see on them. The coat is great. She's got that, like she's built like a little tank. She's got the nice shape to her head. Her ears fit into that roundness on her head. She's got the roundness that you wanna see with the muzzle on the face and the eyes and the eye set. This is like a, to me, this is like a really great example of the breed. My eighth best kitten is my exotic this little girl is built like a tank. 
because normally people think, oh yeah, it's boys, but the girls can actually compete on the same level as the boys. You can see the nice plushness to the coat. You just want to run your hands through it. Really nice shape to her face, that sweet expression, wide open eyes, the ear set, nice pattern to her coat. She is my eighth best kitten. My seventh best kitten is my Norwegian forest cat. This is a really great example of the breed and I breed them. I really love the profile on this cat. This profile, when you see it side on, is completely straight. That's what you want to see. Really nice triangular shape to the face, the ears set, the eye shape, color, and then her coat is coming in nicely. So today she is my seventh best kitten. My sixth best kitten is my Best of Breed Rag Doll. This is a really nice example of the rag doll. You can just see from looking at the body that you know when you pick up that cat from the cage, you would feel the heaviness in your hands that where you want to see it. Like that chest would actually probably fill your hand. Really like the nice shape, the wedge shape to the head, the eye shape, the eye color. Now the eye color in the picture doesn't do it justice, but actually when you see it closer up, it is that sort of vivid blue oval that you want to see. And then like the coat is, the, is beautiful. The coloring, the markings are beautiful as well. Today is my sixth best kitten. My fifth best kitten is my Abyssinian. This is like a beautiful example of the breed. You can see the actual ticking from, from the picture. You don't actually have to get your hands on the cat, though I'd love to get my hands on him to sort of run through and watch the alternating bands of color. Really love the head shape, the way that it just flows into the ears, the eyes. You can see like the, the white bands around the eyes that you want to see. Really nice muzzle shape, great body shape. This is a nice, well, actually, it's a very beautiful Abyssinian. My fourth best kitten is my Sphinx. This is one of the nicer, well, actually, this is one of the best examples of the Sphinx I've actually had the privilege to judge. And you can just see like the body is great on this little girl. So you can see the wrinkling, got the large ears you want to see, the lemon-shaped eyes, the nice little pinch sort of going on in her muzzle. This is a great little girl. My third best kitten is my the best breed Persian. I mean, it's a phenomenal coat on that cat. It just looks like you know, someone once described them as like a fluffy cloud. This is someone like the grooming on this is phenomenal. But they, they, it just, you can just see like the shape of the head, the way that the ears tuck in, the eye color shape. It's just got the very, very sweet expression on her. And you just want to rub your fingers through the fur. Today, it's my third best kitten. My second best kitten is my Siamese. It's a phenomenal body on this girl. When you look at her, you just know if you pick her up and stretch her that there is not going to be any fat on her. She's just that lean tubular shape that you want. Great wedge which flows into her ears. The eye shape complements that whole entire head. In other pictures, you can see the lovely straight profile. This is a lovely example of the breed and my second best kitten. And my best kitten is my Somali. They just love this girl. Like she's got the ticking on her is beautiful. The head shape is the expression, the way that her head's put together. The eyes, you can actually see like the markings that they like to have where it's above the eyes and the the actual markings that come out from the corners of the eyes. The color on her is phenomenal. You can just see like the shine is so lustrous. 
So today she is my best kitten. And I'd like to say thank you to all our volunteers who without them, we could not have done this. 